Hey everybody, it's Blue Turtle, and welcome back to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Let's keep going now that we've done most of 50cc already. Gonna use Cat Peach, which I'm pretty sure is one of the original DLC characters. I could be wrong. I've also got the Master Cyclone, Master Cycle Zero, from Breath of the Wild as well, that I want to point out, since that's one's, that one's a cool one. But let's go to the Leaf Cup. Wario Stadium. Which just feels like it's trying to kill Waluigi slightly. Because I mean... The music is... I believe... Waluigi Pinball or Waluigi... Like, that's what it's known for, at least, this song. And also, this is kind of a lot, like, very similar to, um, Waluigi Stadium from Mario Kart Wii, which I think technically came out after Wario Stadium, possibly on the DS. But anyway, since this is a DS level, it's just a strange level, I guess because of the music. But anyway, let's just... Oh, I thought I could actually go on that bit there. I guess I was wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of something, something else. Possibly. Actually, I'm thinking of Mario Kart Wii, which is strange. But anyway. There's a lot of mud to avoid. Otherwise, you'll slow down. A lot of tricks to do across here. Ow. But it's a very simple track. Dodge everything. Dodge everything. And then we go up there. It's a really simple track. Okay. Ow. But yeah. That that that's the whole thing. And there's nothing to even worry about with 50 cc for this because everyone's just so far behind. Oh, except for that blue shell. Quick, go faster. Outrun it. Outrun it. Outrun it. Outrun it. That run it kind of did for a little bit there, but nope. Also, lightning apparently. I feel like I'm going so slow when I'm zapped by lightning. Okay, we're almost done here. Just have to dodge the fireballs, and we're done. Oop. Sometimes I miss those tricks and then I still try to turn and it makes it go all weird. Anyway. Sherbert Land. I like the snowflakes, which are the colored things at the top of the start line. Also the music, obviously. Sherbet Land's always been amazing. For music. You can also go off down here. As a kind of shortcut, I guess. Not extremely sh short, but still. Back onto the main track. We get to go through this ice cave. So beautiful. 
Oh my goodness, that snowman looks kind of creepy with its head going back and forth. Kind of. But there we go. Now we go down here. Has another kind of shortcut. Except that we're kind of slower in world as well. But we end up right at the start. So there we go. Now let's try go up the upper area, which I don't normally go up through the upper area. Some skater shy guys I'm just gonna blow up for no reason. Yeah, I've so I don't think I've even ever gone up on the upper path before. I always go through the tunnels. Through the underwater. Oh, blue shell, blue shell, no! Blue shell, no! Hop, 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 hop! Nope. I like hopping. <laughs> Just, you know, hop, 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 hop. It's not helping me play better, but still. Got these things here as well. And we can also take advantage of this little ramp here to glide around. There we go. And that's this track, basically. What's the fireworks? Give me more fireworks, please. I probably shouldn't have used that. That's fine. I mean, there's going to be a boo to try and steal an item anyway, probably. They always seem to give, like, a boom box and then somebody else a blue shell and somebody else a boo to steal something. Usually the boom box gets stolen. Anyway, we're just about done here. Wow, there's three peaches right now. There's Cat Peach, Princess Peach, and also Baby Peach. Gonna jump down here. I have a, I have a thing. I have a thing this time. Don't, don't pull it away from me. There we go. I did it. I actually used the boom box for once. Melody Motorway. Which looks really epic. Let's go. And also, while we go down this. It makes a sound, the, the piano, piano music sound thing. It plays the notes that you're going across. Oh, that was a bad move, that was a bad move, that was a bad move, that was a bad move. Nearly went directly into that. And these two ramps swap positions. And these things make you bounce as well, which I actually can... Apparently you can... Time... To boost off of. Also, you can use that little th drum in the middle to bounce off. Across that area there as well, near the end. Which is fairly difficult to do. Okay. My finger's slipping. My finger's slipping. I have to make sure I don't let go of the banana. But my finger is slipping. Okay. Let me just swap these two around. I'm surprised my finger still hasn't slipped off. Okay, now I can let go. Oh my goodness, my, f my finger was slipping for so long. Don't get crushed. Just gonna leave that there. And I'm gonna see if I can bounce off of this again. I didn't get the boost off of it, but I did bounce off across. Oh my goodness. Blue shell. 
Blue shell, 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 blue shell. Should have kept that coin. <laughs> oh my goodness, if you hop on the piano, it makes great sounds. Oh, stay out of the light. Because that's where the plant can reach. Oh my goodness, that's such a great sound. Oh, didn't mean to drop that, but that's fine. I'll turn, please. Okay, that's about to change. I somehow managed to get that. I don't know how. Don't crush me. Nice timing. Oh, crushed. Crushed, just like my dreams. Anyway, that's the end of this track. Also, I like the note blocks. Just there. I like, I like note blocks. But there we go. Yoshi Valley, where the cannon is always pointless, always has been. Except I don't have to bonk into the wall to get onto the bridge where the, where the egg is this time. That's such a funny thing about the original N64 version of this, is just don't worry about missing the bridge, just bonk right through and you'll be fine. Just bonk into the wall next to the bridge and you get pushed right in. But anyway, there's a lot of ways to go. Uh, a lot of them are kind of bad. So I'm just going to go this way and go straight to where I need to be. Except I'm going to bonk into that wall. And obviously the cannon, the cannon is never, I don't think the cannon ever goes anywhere useful. It just goes, oh, mine actually, in this version. I might need to check that. This is probably the best CC to check that. Since I'm gonna do super well anyway, since everyone's not that fast. Crash! Right back into the bridge. Oh, my banana. My banana. These trees have the Yoshi fruit in them as well. Go, 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 go. No, 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 no. Okay, let's check that. Cannon, even though I'm sure it's not that useful. Could also go down to the left there. To go basically the same place where I go normally. Okay, where does this take me? This takes me back over this way. I don't know. I don't see how that was useful. I could have just gone the other way and probably been here faster, except I'm... I mean, I guess I'm at where I need to be, but also that just does not seem useful. It's, it's not efficient. It's just not. I could just go left instead and it would be more efficient than going right up to the cannon and then go left anyway. Get past it. Nope. 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 Now I can't remember but I don't think there are fake item blocks in this mode? In this, in this game? I think, I think, yeah. I don't think there are fake item blocks in this game, which is surprising because there's... That's been a, a normal thing for a lot of Mario Kart games, is the fake item blocks. Let's go up this way. See, that's a lot faster than going up to the cannon. A lot faster. Just gonna leave those there. Fairly easy to dodge those bananas, but still. Didn't mean to throw that, but okay. Oh my goodness, the egg jumped! Boing! Boing egg! Egg go boing! Okay. And we're done. Hop, 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 hop. It helps. I promise.
So that's the Leaf Cup. And also on the back of it, like, it's got the Tanuki Mario thing. It's got the tail coming out of the thing. It's cool because it, even, like, the shape of it has the ears on top. And, oh my goodness, very nice. Well done, Nintendo. Next cup. And we get to start off with Yoshi on the second row. Which, for Yoshi, in, in this particular version, or the Wii U version with the DLC, you can actually pick which colour you, your Yoshi is. Oh my goodness, we got the Yoshi bike and we're Yoshi. It's perfect, it's all supposed to be, except I'm not using it anyway. Anyway, Lightning Cup. Tick Tock Clock. Let's go! Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Gotta go fast. You can also... The hands move around depending on... I don't know, time, I guess. But they, uh, you can do, do trick jumps off of them. You also need to not bonk into those... Things that are swinging back and forth. Need to go with the edge of this. Like go, go with the direction that those cogs are turning. Which you can also trick off, trick, uh, trick jump off the edge of. Go up one of these and then jump there, and jump again. And yeah, that's pretty much how this goes. Okay, just gotta get past that. We are pretty much good. Except for that. Oh my goodness, perfect timed coin again. That's good. Nice. Nice. And nice. Very good. Well, so you can get it, like, you can use this as a very good shortcut acro across that bit there, if you time it right. Okay, final lap, here we go. Might go this way if I can. Just use that as a shortcut. Type thing. And get the boost off of it. Also, the diagrams of the clock over here, that's cool. Going. Oh, is that the back of the group? I think that's the back of the group. Hello, shy guy. Bye, shy guy. Jump. Oh, I was close to failure. Wasn't supposed to actually go across like that, but that's fine. Oh, boy. That didn't go well. Anyway, we're done. And here comes the blue shell to hit me, now that I'm done. Here it comes! Run, Yoshi, run! Get off the track, quick! No, he's dead. It's a shame. Piranha Plant Pipeway. Another very cool... ...course track thing. Has a very Mario feel to it. Very Mario. It's got the end of level castles from Super Mario Bros. kind of thing. It's got the underground, which is most of this. You can also use this water as a uh, way to go faster when you're driving in it. 
Oh my goodness, this underground. It's very cool. Let's go across this. There's a few places here to jump off of, off of the edge of the ramp ramps. And now we go into the underwater underground. Have to make sure we make uh, the most of these currents around here. Be very careful of this prana plant at the end. And there we go. Back out of the thing. We can go actually through some of these uh, fake like bushes and goombas to go faster. But also we don't need to at the moment, so let's just keep going. Grab that power up. Nope, okay then. I'll find a different one, like that one there. Okay, be careful, be careful, be careful. I was getting very close to that prana plant. It was scary. Okay. We're doing well. So I believe the ink from the bloopers can get washed off when you're in water as well. Go, go, go. Oh my goodness, everything's is hitting me. Everything's hitting me. Got blue shell and then lightning and then literally everything. Okay, we've got the the thing over here which we can go over that with. Which is very cool. And now if I shell that, I can kind of hop across here back into the track and skip a little bit. I don't think that was extremely useful because I went off the track. But that's probably more useful in faster CCs. Gonna go through the middle here. Gonna go off track, since you can, kind of. It does make you slightly slower, but still. Cutting corners. Hop that. Wow, that was close. Go, 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 go! Where's the thing? There is no thing. Okay. Cool. Let's just get out of here and be done. Go, 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 go. And there we go. Yoshi's actually just Fred Flintstone. Grumble Volcano. It's definitely changed since the original version. <laughs> If that cave wasn't any indication. That cave looks so different in the Wii version. But yeah, we have Grumble Volcano again. And parts of level will break off as we go through. It's probably a lot less brutal than the original though. I remember jumping. Oh my goodness, I'm remembering playing through Mario Kart Wii now. And, like going across some of these bits, I think. I might be wrong about that, but anyway. This is where the path splits. We've got these... This, this thing here, we can glide. Fireballs do come from the volcanoes to block our path in some of these areas. So we have to dodge those. Go up and down here, dodge the jumping fire things. And up here we have another glider spot. Hello fireball. Okay, it's time for stuff to start breaking off. Since we're on our second lap. It's just how it works. Although I think I'm, it's supposed to have broken off more by now. Like I th I'm pretty sure it's supposed to break off way faster than it is right now. So you can actually watch it break apart. Go, 
Let's go. It's very strange watching the fireballs coming down from the volcanoes. Didn't use my coin at the right time. That's fine. Just need to go up here. How is nothing else broken off yet? Does it just all break off all at once? Towards the end or something? Well, over here is all broken off already. It looks so open. I like what you've done with the place. It's very minim minimalistic. Okay. I probably haven't seen much break off of it because I'm in first place. By a little bit. Go, 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 go. Wow. Okay then. Okay, a blooper ink. This is a hole right underneath that ramp there. That broke off. And I believe it's actually faster in this bit here to go this way. Just a little bit. Hopefully I'm not wrong about that. But there we go, and we are done. And now... I want to have a little reference to my Mario Kart 64 playthrough, so I'm going to be fairly silent for this this next race, which is probably the best track in this game. The entire game, this is the best track ever in all of Mario Kart. Nintendo 64 Rainbow Road. I'm going to be silent for the first lap. Actually, no, it's all... This is one of the courses where it is one lap. So we'd actually have to go through it three times. And there we go, that was Rainbow Road. You have to stay silent for that. Just have to listen to the music because it's just so good. Brings back so many good memories and it's just amazing. Oh my gosh. I love how it's over a city and there's a, the toads on the train going by the edge. It's just so beautiful as well. The stars on the side, oh my gosh. It's just so good. Just so good. Anyway, let's move on. We've got to play this level again.
And lightning cups coming out of a, a cloud, happy cloud thing, base. And there we go. This is just so beautiful, and now I, it's the it's, it's the background here as well, which is just good because I can look at it for more time than ever. But anyway, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.